First Congregational Church, as your pastor, it is my great honor for us to celebrate something going on again in the life of our church. And we're celebrating today the 2021 graduates of the First Congregational Church. Can we say hallelujah? Can we say praise the Lord? And can we take the time in this video to speak to our graduates, to let them know how proud our congregation is of them. And not only that, but to continue to encourage them to keep moving forward in their educational goals. You know, we thank God for this Sunday coming up. We'll be celebrating uh, graduates of our church. We'll be worshiping the Lord for his grace and mercy in their lives. And as a congregation, we are thankful and blessed to say to all our graduates, congratulations on your achievement. Well, I just want to say a few things uh, on this video to us as the church and to our graduates. First, to the Congregational Church. This church's history began with education through the American Missionary Association that established it back then in 1867 and those years following. The educational foundation of this congregation, which still has a history in Raleigh, began as the, 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 the education for colored people, the people who had just been freed from slavery through the American Missionary Association. That led to the establishment of Washington uh, Middle School, High School, as we know it, many of our members have come through that school. So First Congregational Church origins and beginnings began out of an educational effort that continues to this day. We salute all our retired education, edu educators in our congregation and those who are educators right now. So saying all that to say now to our graduates, you are continuing a legacy of learning and education and educational achievements. And we want to celebrate today in the life of the following persons of our congregation. Daniel Carr, Danielle Carr, forgive me, Danielle Carr, who is graduating uh, from the University of Georgia with a Doctor of Philosophy. We thank God for her. And we want to also celebrate Angela Wilkins Pierce, who is graduating from the Safe Haven Interdenominational Bible College and Training Institute with a bachelor's degree in biblical studies. God bless you, Angela. God bless you. Also, we want to celebrate Marlis Whitley. She is graduating from the University of North Carolina at Greensboro with a Bachelor of Arts degree, magnum cum laude, by the way. We're also celebrating Layla Barbie, who is graduating from South Garner High School and will be attending Wake Technical College in the fall. Congratulations, Layla. And also we're celebrating our own Emory Liriano, who is graduating from the eighth grade at the Riverwood Middle School in Clayton. And she'll be going to Clayton High School in the fall. Congratulations, Emory. As pastor of the church, we're proud of each of you. We're proud of Danielle, we're proud of Angela, we're proud of Marlis, we're proud of Layla, and we're proud of Emory. And keep going forward. You know, education is the key. And as we celebrate this Sunday, we want you to know how proud we are of you. But let me leave you with this parting thought because as your pastor, I believe that all education, all learning is a gift from the Lord. This is why in Proverbs 9, 10, the word of God says, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom and the knowledge of the Holy One is understanding. For by me, your days will be multiplied and the years of your life will be added unto you. Again, to all of our graduates and their families, congratulations. And remember that the most important thing to always uh, bring our educational goals that we learn in our schooling down here under is the umbrella of the Lordship of Jesus Christ. And as you continue to seek first his kingdom in the midst of this fallen world, 
He'll provide you with the purpose that your education in this world has equipped you to do and to serve him and to be a witness and a light in the midst of society. So as pastor of the church, along with the proud First Congregational Church, to all our graduates, congratulations. God bless you. And know we thank God for your achievement. Be blessed and encouraged. Bye-bye.